What's up, y'all? It's T. Welcome back. Um, I'm super casual. Can I just say, I love YouTube, but sometimes, y'all, it's like such a show, right? Like, everyone tries to, like, put on their best outfit and, like, you know what? This is how you get me today because I'm excited about this package and I don't want to wait to film this. Um... If you watched my last video, which I will link somewhere in this video, we did it at Abercrombie Hall. Um, we had some favorites, we had some not so good ones. Um, but I'm still on the hunt for my perfect pair of jeans. So I ordered three more. This is my last stitch effort. Otherwise, I'm just gonna stick with the dad jeans that I had gotten last time. But But yes, I am, uh, like I said, still trying to find that perfect pair of pants. And so here we are. We have three more pairs to try on today. I can already tell you I don't like the color of these ones. Which I don't even remember ordering in that color. So fun. But I got a high-rise dad jean, curve love 90s, ultra high-rise and a 90s, 90s ultra high rise street jeans. So let's, are these the ones that I liked the last time that I was just unsure of the size? I'm not too sure, but let me try these on for you and we will go from there. <laughs> you guys, I think we did it. These fit phenomenally. Um, they are the, can you even see this? Probably not. Um, the 90 straight ultra high rise, not curve love, um, in a size 36 and they fit beautifully. Um, I'm trying to look in the mirror behind y'all, but the butt looks great. They fit in my waist. They're slightly tight, but not like uncomfortably tight. They might be for a little bit, but once you wear them, they will stretch. I love the length of them. I love the knee rips. Y'all, y'all we did it. The first pair today and we've done it. Now I'm scared for the rest of them. I do wish that was a little tighter to my back, but honestly, it doesn't bother me that much. the other ones on y'all y'all they were definitely right when they said that the curve love has more fabric in the hip area um these ones don't like i said in my last video if you're somebody that is very tiny in the waist but has a lot of big a lot of big hips so like i said in my last video if you're somebody that has a big like waist to hip ratio um definitely get the curve love but if you're somebody like me that's a little more on the boxy side, get the regular jeans. Don't get the curve love. Um, because there's just not as much fabric to go around right in this area, you know? So I'm, okay. I don't even wanna try the other pairs on, but we're going to. We're going to, we're going to. Okay, let me try the other ones. Okay, I thought the other ones were this style, but I think I like, I think I like this style better, but I like those colors. Um, these are the dad high rise. Um, in a 36 regular, I believe still slight gapping, but nothing to be concerned about. Um, the butt looks good, I think. And uh, yeah, they have little rips in the knees. Regular, I'm 5'3" and they're a great length for me. They just touch the floor sitting. Oh my God, <laughs> a little tight. Not really, not any tighter than the other ones, but um, these are really cute too. I wasn't a fan of the color, but now that they're on, I don't, I don't hate the color. I don't. I'm really, really happy with these jeans. 
like really happy. Okay, let's try the last pair. Okay, so these ones are exactly like the first ones, except they're the curve look. So as you can see, maybe I'll do like a side by side. Um, there's just a little bit more fabric right in the crop, crop, in the crotch and in the hip area, but they still fit basically the same on the butt. So I guess it depends if you want a jean that's a little bit more baggy or if you have a more pronounced lower tummy, these would actually probably be okay for you. Um, but yeah, so I'm glad I got two of the same ones, just one in the curve and one in the regular. Why didn't I do that 17 pairs ago? I don't know, but um, still comfortable-ish to sit. I do find that Abercrombie actually does stretch out quite a bit. Um, so I'm not worried about them being slightly tight. I'm also just like bloated right now. I definitely a Panda Express for lunch. Um, so there's that, <laughs> but... Yeah, I'm glad I got these in the curve love and the regular. I think I'll probably keep most of them. Huh? I don't know. Thank you for joining me on this journey to like find a good pair of Abercrombie jeans. I feel like we found the one. I really love the dad jeans. Uh, they're probably my favorite. I don't know what it is about them. There's just something about the dad jean that I really love. But I also really love these 90 ultra high rises. So I hope this helps somebody out. I hope you can find your perfect pair of Abercrombie jeans. Honestly, if you're just starting out, I would suggest finding a style that you maybe like and then ordering a Curve Love and a regular and seeing where that goes. I do find that these jeans are, I'm gonna keep these, so I'm just gonna rip this off. There are 36, which is a 22 straight. I am a 22 in American Eagle and Abercrombie, I've come to discover. The 24s are just slightly too big on me, but they are very on par with American Eagle. Not as stretchy, but they do stretch out. Hopefully that helps. Um, and Buy two pairs, start there. Don't buy 75 like I did. Honestly, the mom jeans at Abercrombie were not it for my body type. So if you're similar to me in that you don't have a big waist hip area, try the dad, try these 90s straight. Um, they've really worked great. I love all of the ones that I tried on today. So I'm very excited about all of it. I'm excited to share it with y'all. And um, yeah, let me know what you want to see next in the comments. I will try on... Honestly, I'll try most stores for y'all. <laughs> uh, but what's coming up next? I don't even know what we have in the in the archives for y'all. But if you liked this video, like I said, comment below what you want to see. Like it. Please subscribe. I'm just trying to hit a thousand so bad. They say your first thousand is the hardest, and I believe them. Also, maybe post more though, T. Uh, <laughs> weird, wild concept. But um, thank you for watching. I love y'all. Bye.